Well, now at four, a break from the rain, but now that powerful wind whipping Southern California tonight. Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Leslie Marine. And I'm Jasmine Veal. Yeah, hold on to your hats. A dry, breezy start to the work week. How long will the wind cause problems across the Southland? That's the big question. We do have live team coverage on the strong gusts. First, Olga Spina is tracking the conditions in your next weather forecast. But first, KKL's Jake Reiner. He's in the Antelope Valley where the wind really picked up throughout the day, Jake. Oh yeah, all through the day, Jasmine and Leslie. And if you could take a look at our backdrop here that we've provided you, we've got the palm trees, the snow-capped mountains, the sunshine. You get a little bit of everything here in Southern California, and that is also that also includes the weather today, the event wind. There are many spots to view this barren construction site in between gusts. What some might call a wind event, people who live here just call it Monday. Most of the year it blows. That's because wind is a way of life here in the Antelope Valley. You're here in Palmdale. And just shopping today. Yeah. And it's windy. It's very windy. It's very windy indeed. Ruth Howard just blew in from the UK to visit her brother and his wife. And they live in Burr Valley Springs, so we've had snow this morning, so we came out from snow and we've come into the wind and now the sun shines. The summer wind neighborhood experiencing spring wind, bringing trash bins to the ground. And sometimes the gusts bring the experts right to you. I farmed out here for 45 years, so I know all about the wind. When he first moved here all those years ago, Brad Butler set up a pair of aluminum awnings to cover a trailer. After the awnings went gone with the wind, he never made that mistake twice. It's always been windy. It's just something that we've gotten used to. Most of the time of the year, we love it up here. Um, but. We've had about enough of it. We're ready to maybe move out. <laughs> Joe Young and her daughter Charlie live in Acton. Yeah, and it's windier where we are. <laughs> really? It's worse, yeah. yeah. We were just saying it's so cold. Yeah, like, it's freezing. With the wind and everything, like no matter what you have on, it just like cuts through everything. They too lost a large item in the past, a nice 16-foot trampoline the wind made disappear. Was, where did it, it go? It was like, it was so far out in the wilderness, <laughs> it had gone over the fence, so it just... You can't have nice things. <laughs> That's for sure. You can't have nice things. But in case you do have nice things, you want to strap those down or move them inside if possible. I definitely need to invest in a stronger can of hairspray. Reporting live in Palmdale and Jake Reiner, KCAL News. And I see, Jake, you invested in a good pair of gloves. Mm. 